Ghana is one of the most peaceful countries I've ever been to, and I've been to over 50 countries. So it's unmatched. When you come here, you feel supported, love from the men, from the women, the children. It just feels like home. Come home. It's time. I am in Ghana living my best life and really pursuing my dreams. I always feel like Ghana is the place that has welcomed me to pursue any dream that I have, and that's why I'm here doing it. Hello, my name is Pamela Beckham, and I am from Florida. We just purchased an apartment here, and I'm going to be one of you. I love you people. I love this country. I love everything about Ghana. I've been watching you now for a whole year, and I'm finally here. I feel like I'm home. And I just love this country. This is a beautiful place, and I love it here. And this will be my home. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Hello, guys. My name is Delphina. I'm a Nigerian living in Ghana. So today, I want us to check this video, foreigners sharing their experience about Ghana. Let's watch. What do you get from Ghana of feel that you don't feel in America? Peace, 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 peace. Ghana is one of the most peaceful countries I've ever been to, and I've been to over 50 countries. So it's unmatched. When you come here, you feel supported, love from the men, from the women, the children. It just feels like home. It's not a coincidence that we're all here at this time. I believe that we are a collective of love. And so why have fear in that? You know that you're loved, you know that you're supported, you know that God has you and you're amongst your people. I mean, I have every reason to be confident. I'm God's child. Come home. It's time. <laughs> I live in many different countries in my life, but moving to Ghana has changed me in ways I never expected. It has made me more culturally aware. Immersing yourself in a new culture gives you a deeper understanding of global diversity. And definitely more open-minded, <laughs> being exposed to different customs, beliefs and perspectives broadened my worldview, making me more accepting of differences. And so much more joyful in everyday moments. Living here taught me to find joy in simple gatherings or even a shared meal or dance with people I don't even know. My name is International Hannah and I'm from Chicago. I am in Ghana living my best life and really pursuing my dreams. I always feel like Ghana is the place that has welcomed me to pursue any dream that I have, and that's why I'm here doing it. Ghana has always been a place that has made me feel welcome. From the moment that I came to Ghana, I always felt like the doors were open, the people were welcoming, and the opportunities were just everywhere. And so it was just a place that I felt I could come and I could really put my skills to use and see the growth for myself, but also help to grow Ghana within itself in the economy. Hmm, I had a lot of Joe off, so I don't know if I'm gonna be able to say that, but I know my number one is Kele Wele. I love Kele Wele, it's so good, but only when it's ripe. If you're thinking about coming to Ghana, stop thinking and just come. You have to just make the move. Um, and, and I don't mean you have to actually move here, but you should just get up and just go. Like, don't think too much about it. Don't. Don't think too deep into it. Don't plan too far around it. Just book that flight and come on, sis. Come on, brother. You're going to love it. Hello, my name is Pamela Beckham, and I am from Florida. But we just purchased an apartment here, and I'm going to be one of you. I love you people. I love this country. I love everything about Ghana. I've been watching you now for a whole year, and I'm finally here. I feel like I'm home. My name is Alice Winston. I'm from Maryland, USA, and I just love this country. I I just feel safe, and I walk the street. I don't have to look. I don't look over my my shoulder to see who's following me or or trying to rob me. This is a beautiful place. We just purchased a. Uh, we they call an apartment. We call it a condo in uh, in USA, and I love it here. And this will be my home. Hey everybody, I'm Roy. All I got to do is say, Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. I've been in Africa for a few days now, and oh my gosh, I'm gonna tell you guys a few things that I love about being in Africa. Number one, the sun. Like, what do you mean it's November and it's literally this sunny, guys? Like, it's over 30 degrees in November. Like, I understand Africa is like beside the equator, but guys, like, it's so warm. If you're looking for a summer holiday around winter time, come to Africa. 
Next, I love how cheap everything is, but I can't lie. When you go to like, the tourist area, they start charging like European prices. Because what do you mean? I went to KFC yesterday and it was eight euro eighty eight. Like, babe, it should be fifty cent. We're in Africa, anyways. But things are so cheap. Oh my gosh, me and my mom went to get jello fries and it was actually like ten cent. Ten cent for jello fries, and it's not because of bad quality. It's literally just because like that's what their normal price is. Crazy. I got my hair done, and I got my eyelashes, and my nails, and my toes done. Guys, it was under a hundred euro. Like, I think it was probably like fifty euro. I love how helpful everyone is oh my gosh like literally you go to the shop someone's packing your things into the um, bag for you when you're doing your shopping you go to the restaurant you want to pack your food away they're packing it away from you like they're always so helpful maybe because we're tourists to be honest maybe that's why like people are always really nice in resorts so i think that is definitely why but the food here is so 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 good me and my mom haven't haven't gone to so many restaurants but so far we are loving it you have to come to africa i'm literally i feel like i'm gonna come every single year not just to ghana i want to go to some other places in africa too I am loving Ghana so much. Look at how I'm glowing with my hair and my nails and everything that I got done. So cheap. This year's time to listen to the racist and come to Africa. At least all these things you've heard is not coming from my mouth. We we will not hold our hands like that. We have to be posting videos, yeah, you know, for a better Africa. So guys, I really appreciate you. You, 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 you. Especially you. You and you. You, 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 I mean you for supporting this channel i appreciate you a lot you should know that i love you i love you now and always okay so this brings me to the end of my video if you are watching from tiktok or facebook please follow this channel like this video and share this video and if you are watching from youtube please subscribe to the channel like this video share this video to as many eyes out there i believe they'll watch and also learn one or two things on this clip i love you guys always bye